I want to ask you about those larger ambitions for space in, in a moment, but just to finish with this uh, question of, of space tourism, what sh rules should there be? Is, is this an area that NASA should try to have some regulation? Is there a way that this can be made more accessible so that more people uh, can experience uh, this uh, extraordinary uh, uh, adventure? How are you thinking about about the space tourism going forward? All of the above. If <clears throat> the so-called space tourists are going to the International Space Station, then uh, what uh, I am uh, insisting on, that they go through all the training, the medical exams, the psychological, psychiatric exams, that any one of our astronauts would do because they are going to a space station with astronauts and cosmonauts uh, that is doing uh, genuine uh, productive work and research. And I don't want somebody getting up there and going crazy. So NASA is all over this and will require that. If they're going on a venture on their own, uh, then that's a different matter. Now, I might say, David, that all of this uh, started 11 years ago when Senator Kay Bailey Hutchinson and I, along with the Obama administration, formulated this dual path that we're on, a commercial path as well as the government path. And we are seeing that happening now in uh, 3D Technicolor in front of our eyes. We're also seeing an expansion of that public-private partnership. And a good example is the efforts on the moon. And I'll tell you about that if you want to hear. 